What's up YouTube? It's your girl the Mac of All Trades and I'm back with another haul video. Now for today's haul video I have a Hobby Lobby haul and before we get into this Hobby Lobby haul who likes the new like background so to speak. So yesterday I spent like all day doing this and I'm pretty sure I like it. Like I'm looking at it in the camera and I'm like yeah I like it. It, it it looks cute you know the other background the like dark blue it was just too dark and I felt like um like it just made the videos darker you know what I mean it's a white like faux wood grain here on the back wall and you guys I absolutely love it um if if, it, if any of you are youtubers and want like cheap ass backgrounds you guys go to like Hobby Lobby and get uh, they sell it in big, huge rolls, but it's um, meant for using on like school bulletin boards, and that's what that's what um, that is right there over. Ugh, try and point over there, like the that is what that wood grain is, and then this is that partition thing that I got um, ninety percent off over the summer that I repainted. So yeah, you guys. Um, also, I cut my hair I think it might be a little short for my liking there was a lot of dead weight so I had to get rid of it and I colored my hair but anyway let's go ahead and get right into this Hobby Lobby haul so this Hobby Lobby haul um I'm just going to be showing you all the happy planner stuff that I got you guys if you are looking for more happy planner stuff for your happy planner or if you just want to get started doing happy planner go to Hobby Lobby right now because all the Hobby Lobbies near me and I went to how many? Three, four? I went to four different Hobby Lobbies but they are having a huge clearance on a lot of Happy Planner items and so I picked up a ton of stuff because when you see it at that big of a discount you guys just stock up on it because I absolutely love my Happy Planner which I do need to do that video for you guys where I show you my Happy Planner. I think I'll do that in conjunction with this but anyway I keep talking and I just need to show you guys what I got. The first thing I'm going to show you was not on sale. These were regular price but I did use one of those 40% offs. If you guys hear a bunch of noise it's just Carissa's room getting worked on. I know I should find um, other times to film but you guys while everybody else is off doing something that's when I like to film but anyway and then they're the expander discs for the happy planner because um I'll tell you why I got these here in this video but later on but these were $5.99 but I used the 40% off on these and I'm gonna start picking up a pack of these anytime I go to Hobby Lobby because you guys the sm the small little rings just ain't working for me i like to stuff my happy planner full so i got those then um you guys so they had the i had like i'm i'm super obsessed with the happy planner stuff but this is the happy planner sticker book storage and it's designed to fit 21 value pack sticker books so you know the sticker books that they have this is designed to fit 21 of those little books and you guys this was regular $14.99 but I got it for $3.74 I don't know what they mean by 23 pieces like is that how many pieces it takes to put this thing together because if that is the case um I don't know so you get some like label stickers with it and then here is the thing itself And then this has like the sticky tape kind of stuff and it just goes oh oh i just freaking broke it but i can re-glue it you guys so it just looks like that and you guys when i do my happy planner like showing you mine i'll show you all this stuff with everything in it and all that good 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 stuff okay and so then i also picked up two of these these are the happy planner recipe organizers space for 160 recipes so this is what it looks like let me here i got two of them okay 
So these were regular $27.99, but I got them for $6.99 each. And here's what the front looks like. And then on the back, it shows you kind of what it looks like, but it has like all these different sections here. So like favorites, main dishes, small dishes, soup, soups and salads, healthy breakfast, dessert, and miscellaneous. So it has all these. So I got two of these because one of them I'm actually going to be using to make for my son's girlfriend, like a little recipe book she loves to cook and things like that. And so um, I just wanted to get her like a little cookbook that she could have like this that she could add to number one. And number two, I was going to put some of like my favorite recipes to make that my son likes in here for her so I thought that would be a really cute idea but I did get two of these and then the other one is for myself because um you guys my recipe organization is terrible everything's kind of like in one of those uh photo boxes that you can get from Michael's which it works out good but I need to go through the recipes and like weed through it and really decide what I'm actually going to want to use or not and plus since I've been buying a ton of cookbooks from Dollar Tree I really don't need to hold on to a whole lot of the recipes you know what I mean this was actually something that was on my uh wish list in my regular happy planner so I was super excited that I was going to get to cross that off and then I also picked up one of these let me kind of take this part off real quick because it's like kind of not as easy to get off it's for some reason like taped on there but um I'll just go like this so I got this one and this is another recipe organizer but it's smaller and this was regular $19.99 but I got it for $5.49 and so let me show you what it has space for 160 recipes so I have the smaller one and you guys like I bought those bigger rings so I could put bigger rings in here because I also bought a whole bunch of the refill pages. I bought, let's see, four of them and they were two of them. See, this is the thing about shopping at the different Hobby Lobby. Sometimes the prices vary a little bit. So two of them were $1.49 regular. I paid $1.49 each for them, but they were regular $4.99. And then these ones I paid a dollar twenty for each, and they were regular four ninety nine. But here is what they look like: the little recipe cards that stick in here. And so I'm going to be using expander rings to expand this to make it bigger. But it has like all the different tabs here for all the different recipes. And for this smaller um, book, um, I'll put a bunch more recipes in this as well. But um, with that bigger one, I want to primarily make it more of the recipes that I make regularly. You know what I mean? Just so it's easier to get to it and everything like that. And I also picked up a pack of these refills. And these are just the Monday through Sunday refills. There's 60 of them in here. And these are regular $5.99. But I got them for $1.49. And here's what they look like. They're like rainbow you know what I mean? But I like using these in my Happy Planner to keep track of things. Um, even though, you know, the Happy Planner, you can keep track anyway. But there's like extra things that I like to write in, especially like with my YouTube stuff. And that's what I will use these for. Then um, I picked up some more of the bigger paper. So these have a purpose as well. And I'll get to that after I show these to you. But there's 40 sheets in here. And these are just the bigger refill papers. These are regular $8.99. But I got them for $2.24 each. And they have like the leopard print on there. It shows you on the back what it looks like. Um, but I got these. I got three of them. And I got these because let me show you this. So, um, all the other happy planners I have that are like dated or whatever, you know, that doesn't matter to me. I always just like take out the dated parts or whatever and do my own thing. Or if they're not dated, I just hold on to them, you know, and I can date them how I want. 
but I did not have another one of the big ones. All of them are the medium sized ones that I had. So I got this because what I'm going to be doing is transferring all of my makeup inventory into one of these. So I'm going to have to get more extenders um, to make it bigger. But I want to transfer all my makeup inventory into one of these because right now it's just in a three ring binder on notebook paper. And I figured this would, number one, keep it better organized because there's like tabs, even though I do have tabs in the inventory. This will give me just more versatility to have things more organized and... I'm just obsessed with the happy planners so i did get this and this was regular 14.99 but i got it for 3.74 and it's just notes it's basically a happy planner notebook you guys and that's why i got that filler paper is to put it in here and so yeah i'm i'm excited to get transferring all that it's going to be a process but it will get done eventually. And I also picked up two of these um, paper refills and these were $5.99 regularly, but I got them for $1.49 each. And they have like the pink foiled leopard print at the top. And again, they are double-sided and there are 24 refills in each pack. Then I got to match that, the smaller ones like this. I use all the different sizes in my big happy planner, you guys. So you can also do that if you have a happy planner because sometimes you know you just might need to write some notes to yourself. Just stick one of these in between the pages and there you go. That's what I do. And this has 24 in here and I paid $1.12 for them and they were regular for 49. And then I picked up, these are block pads. 100 sheets in here and these were regular $12.99 but I got them for $3.24 and here is what it looks like. All the stuff that has these girls on here, all this stuff is um, on clearance at Hobby Lobby so look for all that. But I figured this would be good for lists and things like that and then I could put stickers over here if I want. You know there's so many different things you can do and there's 100 sheets in there I think I already said that. Then I picked up this pack of the paper. There's 40 sheets in here, but there is multicolors in here, you guys. So let me show you all the different multicolors. I paid $1.49 for these, but they were regular. Um, I'm not sure. It doesn't really say. I would assume like $8.99 or $5.99, somewhere in there. But it doesn't say. Usually it says on the back, but it doesn't. But yeah, it has all different colors and kinds. So, and just so you know, I'm not the only one in my household that does a happy planner. Carissa also has a happy planner. And then um, Kendall's girlfriend has a happy planner because I, you know, I be giving happy planners to everybody. And then um, my niece Cassidy has one too. They had some sticker, uh, the sticker pads on Clarence as well. So I got two different ones because I have so many stickers. And these were both regularly $19.99 but they had them on clearance for $4.99 and this one's the adulting one so of course I had to get it because you know I'd be adulting but uh yeah here's what some of the stickers look like so you guys can see you guys I am obsessed with the sticker books you guys I get so obsessed of putting the stickers inside everything it's just so much fun and then um, I got this one. This is every day. Um, and there's 885 stickers in this one and 740 in that one. But this is just, you know, it has all the different, the, the girls on there. All the, those girls. Whoever those girls are. They're your happy planner friends. That's who that is. But yeah. So I thought that was cute. And I'm actually going to be continuously going to Hobby Lobby to check you know um if this stuff goes down even further because if it does then I'm really gonna go crazy and buy more but um then I also picked up and this doesn't really this isn't part of the happy planner like collections but these are just alphabet stickers they were regular $3.99 marked down to 99 cents they had a ton of stickers that were marked down at Hobby Lobby but I got these lime green ones for me to use um, in my happy planner during um, Lyme Disease Awareness Month because that is in May. And so I'm gonna be using these for that. So that is going to conclude my happy planner haul from Hobby Lobby. Let me know what you think was like the best thing that I got 
from Hobby Lobby because you guys like I had to put a lot of stuff back because I was like girl you do not need this much happy planner stuff like you do not need all this I was just like throwing it in the cart I didn't even care and then my daughter was giving me this look like mom you need to calm down and I was like oh, you're right I better put some of this back <laughs> let me know what you think was like the best deal you know what i mean because i'm always curious what you guys think is like the best deal i got for me it was the um recipe books like that was but that was like the icing on the cake for me but i think that's because it was something that i had on my wish list that i was finally getting to you know have but uh yeah i hope you all enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you liked it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified whenever i upload a new video and with all that being said thank you again for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye me and sweet betty ain't never seen a bear that can dance before it's a one step two step three step four follow the code to any dance more dance dance to go to dance all around the country store